good morning students how are you all hope you all are good okay shall we learn today accountancy in accountancy uh, we were learning the theory portion of the double column cash book isn't it double column cash book we have the cash uh, amount column and one more amount column as discount column we know in the debit side there will be a column as discount allow and on the credit side the discount are received okay once we make payment we will get the discount received when we receive cash we have to allow discount that is it. okay so now we will see the illustration okay i will read out the illustration enter the following transactions in your cash book with the cash and discount columns cash in hand paid to Ra ramanathan by depositing in cash deposit machine Discount allowed by him and purchased goods for cash. Cash received from Raja Gopal. Cash in hand, we will write balance brought down. Here you see. Two amount to column discount and cash here discount and cash then we have one more here voucher number here receipt number okay so first one two balance brought down eleven thousand five hundred paid to Ramanathan so by Ramanathan account three hundred then ten rupees discount received okay then purchased goods for cash by purchases. Then cash received, so 2 Raja Gopal, 980 and 20. Sold goods for cash, 2 sales, 400. And paid cash to Shanti, by Shanti, 2 amount. Then paid wages by cash. Then paid to Sanji, by Sanji, 390, 10 rupees. Okay, then we need to balance. When we, no need to balance the discount column, we have to write the total amount as it is here 25 here 20 the other one when we balance credit side we will get the balance okay so that one next month first day to two balance brought down okay now we will do the third exercise okay second one we have completed now double column cash book okay next one we will read Enter the following transactions in Ahmed's cash book with the discount and cash columns. Cash balance, cash sales, paid to parent, discount allowed. Sold goods to Perumal on credit, this one will not appear. And cash withdrawn for personal use. Purchased goods from Subramanian. Here, purchased goods from Subramanian will not appear. Paid to bank. Cash received from Perumal. Here, Perumal, where it is, we should see. In full settlement. Here, sold goods to Perumal on credit 19,200. So, the 200 will be, okay, discount allowed. Draw a check for office use. Okay, here cash is coming inside. Then paid cash to Gopalakrishnan, payment. Paid cash to Subramanian, it's also payment. Here discount received, here also discount. Cash purchase, cash paid for advertising. So we will do this one. Okay. We will uh, use in the books of Ahmed. Yeah. 
Ich habe Discount und Cash Karan. Okay, here to amount column. This count is smaller column enough. Then we are left. Then voucher number, date, one, two amount column. Okay, then we are left. Receipt number date. Okay, date particulars. Receipt number. LF discount cash. Date particulars. Receipt voucher number. LF discount cash. Cash balance, how we should write debit side. Okay, date 2017 October 1. Here 2017 October. We will write first one. Two, balance. Brought down. Okay. 37,500 cash card. Then cash sales. To sales account. 33,000. Paid to VLN. Payment. By valence account. Fifteen thousand eight fifty. Then one fifty discount. Then sold goods to Perumal. It will not appear, isn't it? On credit. Cash withdrawn for personal expenses. Cash withdrawn. The receipt. Send it to cash withdrawn. Cash withdrawn for personal expense. Drawings account that are to cash. So by payment. Drawings. Four thousand eight hundred. Purchased goods from Subramanian. goods from Subramanian that one also credit purchases will not come then paid to bank here payment so by bank by bank 22,700 cash received from Perumal So date 25, 2, Perumal account. Nineteen thousand. That one, nineteen thousand two hundred. So two hundred is discount allowed. Draw a check for office use. So here, cash account data to bank. To bank. Okay, 
isn't it? It's 26. Seventeen thousand five hundred. Paid cash to Gopala Krishnan by Gopala Krishnan twenty seven. Two thousand nine fifty. Yes, fifty. Paid cash to Subramanian. Twenty eight. Fourteen thousand two hundred. Subramanian, how much? Fourteen thousand three hundred. So, 100 discount. Good. Cash purchases. Buy purchases. 13,500. Cash paid for advertising. So, 30. Buy advertising. Thousand five hundred. We have entered all the transactions. Now we will balance the account. Okay. Which side more? Here thirty-seven, thirty-three, nineteen, seventeen. Here only more. Okay, so we will write the total amount here. Zero. Zero. Five plus five ten. Balance one eight eight seventeen twenty twenty seven balance two three four seven ten one lakh seven thousand there is the same amount here also one lakh seven thousand now October thirty one by balance carry down zero five five plus five ten balance one nine seventeen twenty four thirty three thirty five forty forty five forty five plus five fifty balance five one six nine and 13, 15, 17, 21, 26, 26 plus 1, 27, balance 2, 3, 4, 6, 7, 7 plus 3, 10. So that is the balance, 31,500. So next month, November 1, 2, balance brought down 31,500 okay then the next one you enter the following transactions in cash book with discount and cash column of Anand 2017 December 1 cash in hand sold goods for cash credit purchase from Gandhi this will not appear credit purchase then received from GoPro discount allowed. Cash paid to electricity charge. Cash paid for electricity charges. Bought computer and its accessories by cash. Then paid cash to Gandhi. Full settlement of his account. Here, uh, Gandhi credit purchase from Gandhi twenty thousand. We have paid cash to Gandhi nineteen thousand seven hundred. So the remaining three hundred is the discount received. Received cash from. Thiruvengadam, 8,900, discount allowed 100, paid trade expenses in cash. Okay, shall we do this one? We will use only one page. You have to use both the pages. Okay, in the books of Anand.
कैश बुक विथ कैश एंड डिस्काउंट कॉलम ओके हियर वन अमाउंट वन डिस्काउंट वन एल एफ वन वाउचर नंबर पर्टिकुलर्स डेट कैश कॉलम डिस्काउंट कॉलम एल एफ रसीट नंबर वन पर्टिकुलर्स डेट ओके वन लाइन one word i will write for each one particulars then receipt number l discount cash date particulars voucher number l discount received this one discount allowed then cash first one cash in hand year 2017 december 1 to balance brought down nineteen thousand five hundred and sold goods for cash for two sales thirty two thousand credit purchase will not appear then received from gopu to gopu Eleven thousand eight hundred and two hundred discount. Cash paid for electricity charges. So here date two thousand seventeen, December fifteen. By electricity charges. Twelve thousand five hundred. bought computer and its accessories by cash sixteen thousand eight hundred paid cash to Gandhi by Gandhi Nineteen thousand seven hundred. We purchased him for twenty thousand. So nineteen thousand seven hundred payment, three hundred discount received. Received cash from Tiruvengadam. Date twenty eight. To Tiruvengadam. Eight thousand nine hundred cash. Hundred discount allowed by paid trade expenses by trade expenses three thousand five hundred. So we will balance the account. Okay. So debit side only more. So we will write the total. Zero zero seventeen twenty two balance to ten eleven thirteen twenty two balance to three six seven seventy two thousand two hundred and balance here thirteen twenty twenty five. Twenty five plus seven thirty two balance three five eleven twenty twenty three twenty three plus nine thirty two balance three plus three six six plus one seven 
So the last date December 31 by balance carry down. Okay, 19,700. So the next month, so next year, isn't it? So 2018 January 1 to balance brought down. 19,700. Here you should not draw line. Okay, students, I think you have understood this. So, again, you learn the question answers also. Okay, learn the question answers and write down these problems in your notebook. Okay, students, thank you very much.